everybody, welcome to Lot of Way. I'm Jessica, and today's video is a homeschool show and tell. The homeschool show and tell is an open collaboration hosted by Abby from Rooted and Rest and myself. Our goal with the homeschool show and tell was really just to show that there's not one right way to homeschool. And we do that by bringing homeschoolers together from around the world to share their take on a different topic each month. This month's topic is holiday homeschooling. So we're gonna have people sharing what their holiday homeschool plans are or what it looks like to homeschool through the holidays for them. Now, I actually already shared our homeschool holiday plans. So if you missed that, I will link that right here for you guys to go watch. So instead of sharing our plans with you today, I thought it would be fun just to bring you along on a typical holiday homeschool day in the life. So that is what we're gonna be sharing with you guys today. Here's a good Christmas trivia. What kids around the world leave out for Santa? In France, they leave out biscuits. In Sweden, they leave out coffee. In the United States, we leave out... Cookies and milk. Mm -hmm. United Kingdom leaves out meat pies. Chile leaves out a sponge cake. And in Denmark, they leave out... Do you remember what they leave out in Denmark or Norway? you. <laughs> they leave out a porridge. Porridge with rice and butter on top. Yeah, it's like a rice pudding porridge, yes. I Something. probably will never forget that. <laughs> Would you rather open a bunch of Christmas presents covered with a ridiculous amount of sticky tape or presents that have been wrapped using rolls and rolls of toilet paper? Rolls and rolls of toilet paper! Why? Because toilet paper is fun. I figured she was going to say because toilet paper isn't sticky. Because can you imagine her sensory touching oh, stickies? Yeah. Yeah. She would be like, I'm not opening that present. Yeah, that's a bit much. for today's activity? Of course, it's my favorite time of the day. Okay. Pick one out of the box. Okay. I want this one. It looks lucky. It looks lucky? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what you picked. You picked load up the gifts three digit by one digit multiplications. So you're gonna solve the equation on the sleigh, which is these right here. And then once you solve the equation on the sleigh, you have to match it to the correct gift, okay? And you can use your pencil and write it on here if you want, okay? All right, so here I'll lay all the gifts out for you. Ready for mealtime Monday? Yes, ma'am. Okay, I am going to stuff our family Christmas cards into envelopes and then I will start addressing them. Who are you gonna make cards for? Um, two of my friends. Okay, are you gonna do the color ones where you get to color them? Yes, ma'am. All right, go ahead and get started. Have you seen our family Christmas cards yet? They're really pretty. I love the like golden glitter on them. Yeah, me too. Golden glitter makes everything better. Just glitter in general. It does. Mm. I think I'm gonna use washi tape to close these because I 
am not licking that thing. Try to see if it's a peel. It's not. Why don't you? I can use a damp sponge though. Damp sponge? Yeah, you can get a sponge and you just get it a little bit wet and then you go do 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 like that and then when it's the same as licking it. But you don't have to get that nasty taste in your mouth. True. And then we give you some washi tape though to make it look pretty and decorative. And then there's plenty of Christmas stickers too. I can't wait to add some. Yeah. I'll also probably use some to close down the flap. Okay. So we are going to make star-shaped Suspiros from Costa Rica. They are going to be little delicate merengue cookies that are popular year-round, but especially at Christmas and Easter. It's only going to call for three ingredients. They're supposedly easy to make with what we have on hand. So what ingredients are we going to need? Three egg whites, one cup of sugar, and one teaspoon of lime juice. Okay. Now do you know how to get just the egg whites? Mm-mm. So we're gonna separate the yolk from the egg white. So the yellow from the white part of the egg. And we're only gonna use the white part. And then we are going to beat the egg whites on medium speed, which you can see here, it goes from one to 10. So if the low speed is one and the high is 10, what is the medium gonna be in there? Um, well, there isn't a five, so I'm gonna go somewhere between four and six. Yeah, so we'll start on four and then go to six. And basically you can't over mix it, but you can under mix it. So we're gonna beat the egg whites until they're soft peaks. So until it's kind of standing up. Then we're gonna add the sugar one to two tablespoons at a time until it's mixed and then we'll add the lime juice, okay? Once we've done that, we're gonna fill our piping bag and we're gonna try to pipe out little shapes on the cookie sheet. Don't and then it's- they look like these? Yep, yeah, they kind of have like a little star rose type of kisses shape. And then they have to bake for how long? One hour and a half to two hours at 175 degrees Fahrenheit. Yep, and then we're gonna turn the oven off and it's going to have to cool for another two to three hours. So basically we're going to cook these tonight but we will not be eating them until tomorrow because total two plus three is gonna take how many hours? Five. Yeah, so basically we will let them cool overnight and then we'll try them tomorrow, okay? See who goes first? Mm -hmm. Alright. I got a two. Emily got a five. Well, Emily, you get to go first. Three. One, two, three. Yay! I'm not a cotton headed <laughs> ninny mug. Uh, excuse oh, me. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Rules, rules of the game. Five. Hi. One, two, three. Oh, wait, four, no, five. no. Okay. No, I'm now it's my turn. Five. Babe, can you move me with you? Thank you. Get on the base list. Four. One, two, three, four. So close. Four. One, two, three, four. Need a three.
I get? All right, you got five, babe. One, two, three, four, and I am the finisher. You forgot to say five. Five, you won. <laughs> Good job, babe. Thank you, thank you, thank you.